Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Death, Death Gambit, Gambit. After Life. With me, Demox. When we last left off, we beat the body surge and then tried to get out of this place. Well, we got to the journey's end and it looked okay to work the chuff and then we said no, we'll go that way. Mostly because we couldn't jump high enough to get that way. We need the flower upgrade. Aussie. We don't get enough deaths, we can you know um literally jump up and grab all the loot there. For there. Bonk, bonk. Come on, go. Well, there took out the guy, the um, sleeping guy in. Just fall through. Whee! Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. Boy. How many have we got? Thirteen. So we could actually have fallen in a more like stone. Tome of endless, some really nice looking boots. I do wonder if there are like X number of carrots in the game. I could probably hit him. It will not end well. I believe I took out the guy, the me over here. And he wants to distract me while these things attack. Let me go. Please give a shell. Do I have a shell? A snail? Would you like a snail? Oh! -hoo. I got three little guys on that. Excellent. I don't know if you got a little floaty is. Where the floaty is, that gets me. That gets me, um. Some other guy. Okay, so I can't get from that him there. Of well, course, I got 55% of the map done. Map. 
Okay, so I gotta figure out... Mm. So I need to go this way, but I don't know how. I thought I need like, a flower to get there, so I might have to go through Skira's... Skira's Sky Tomb. I'll try anyway, and see if I can figure out how to get through it. I can get out this way. So I was even very, very stupid earlier, and could have actually made it up the thing, but again, without like wall climb or something, I'm missing, probably missing some skills. That makes it so you can actually get out. Stabby in the bucky. Okay. You can't get through this if you didn't use any plumes. Quick and plume. May I not pick that up? Or does it like reset because I didn't use any plumes in this area? I mean, I wonder if these plumes, if you don't use a plume at the time of you trying to get it. Let's uh, see. Ah, but different plumes. That's a better heal than what I've got. I enjoys having better plumage. Ow. Hi. Ow. Oh, I've got some stuff to f scrap. That's good. There's no phoenix here now. Because we pull the lever up here, we it generate the steps we need to get up here. Nope. <laughs> the sky tomb. A tomb in the sky. Tomb in the sky. Yippee ya yay! That I just uh, discovered. Okay, so without st stomp, I couldn't get into here. You can't get through this bit because I don't have the ability to jump high enough to get do anything. But now in this bit, and there's a whole great another one of those things. Look at beast tree. No, seriously, I like a beach street, please. Not the bosses, I like a beach street itself. Right. Ah, the Wraith King Sirad. 
You guys to talk about. Okay, who's this guy? A pilgrim of humble origins driven by fierce ambition to carve his name in the history. Above the vestiges of the gra of Gradatum, he discovered the source of immortality, and with it, the power to found the nation of Cyrodon. Ah, so he's the one who raided Gradatum. That says bunny with a thing over there. Again, without the ability to, um... Okay. What happens now? It reads, Stay in the circle to deactivate the magic. Okay. Thanks for the tip. I don't know who you were. We usually popped on no one screamed at my head. We usually Wraith King. I keep thinking that that's a push to a button to get to the map. So we gotta go. This is all zoom. So thankfully, the zone's not humongous. At the same time, the zone's not humongous. What does these things do? Oh wow. Please. So I'm gonna, gonna die through this. Uh, light speed? No. Purple shields we removed with, abil with abilities. Good to know. So I had to um, stand in the circle and get blapped really badly. Someone's firing bombs at me. Oh, they're going there. I need a respite spot and soon. I don't think I rested since that. Oh god, I don't think I rested since down here. Oh, it's a long way up. Please tell me there's another respite somewhere nearby. I came all the way over here to do this. Well, if I had now, I'd be running with the blast, not against it. Could really do with some blooms back though. Like, manically do with some blooms. Spawn up first, then jump up. Heh. 
Do not underestimate the power of a futuristic gun. Dragonberry. I wonder if that's the thing we wanted. Thing we really wanted. So I gotta go up one side, then jump across one of these ones. One, two. Mushrooms, an essence aura, and all the opposite if you haven't used a phoenix plume. Alright, so you need to, so if you get there without using phoenix plume, the chest opens. Okay. Ha ha ha! You cannot stop my awesome. Um. Actually, I don't care about doing that to be honest. It's much more than the bomb. Those spells are annoying. Those are darkness motes. Point out that darkness motes can be thought do less damage to me. Because I am darkness. It's ping me there. But I'm pretty sure I'm going up. I need to light them. Oh. Oh, skip through that one. Right. Hey, best. Create death idol. Rest. Yes. <laughs> I don't care if I've respawned everything below me. I've rested. <laughs> That's all I care about. Uh, vitality is good. You know what? A little more fin damage. With the bonus I get with the armor, I'm actually getting about. Probably getting like 200% damage output. That like, gives everything a magic boost. Strength damage goes up, health goes up. Jones is rated than that. But again, strength and magic damage both go up. Probably the amount of um, stamina I've got. I've got like 600 health. I'm not going to save up the rest of my points. It's getting expensive to level up. I mean, the grind is starting to feel the grind now. But, okay, so we're here. So we went through there, but we couldn't continue that way because we hit a, a wall. Boss. I haven't read the rest of the book. Hold on. Scratch that. Boss. He subjected the masses with the subjugated the masses with the promise of immortality, germinating a religion that taught people to fear death, though he withered with age into frail fragile bones and spectral rags, his willpower to conquer death endures. Yeah. At least he has plus ten percent damage against this guy. 
plus what I get from having from uh, augmenting my plumes. I wonder if I went back down now and very carefully went to that um thingy chest we found over here. You know, slip through and take no damage and get to here. Would that give me, let me get that chest? You know what? Slight longer episode. Let's find out. That trap's useless if I'm just going down thing. Use a plume. Seed of knowledge. Okay, good chest. Yep, yeah, good chest. That gives us a seed. Item consumer gives a talent point. Uh, I planted it on the ground and gains create the bloom to a flower that creates a creature of Gaia. I am tempted to keep all that. We have those though. I could easily make my scythe a more powerful scythe. But at the same time, I really want to get my hands on a, on a uh, better scythe. I mean, don't mind now if we use a, a thing. They were never going to beat me. So those traps. Reset, don't do that. Dream Nox, you're gonna get yourself killed. I want to impress death by making it through his area without dying repeatedly. Haha, <laughs> I rock. <laughs> so if we go the other way, it should give us a link to get out of this place. And that, you know what? That way, boss. Right hand. Exploration. I'd rather have exploration right now. Who knows, maybe again this boss will give us the thing we need to do more stuff. Hmm. Anyway, that's for next time. So until then, until then, I'll catch y'all later. See ya!